O oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Audi benigne conditor, nostras preces confletibus, sacrat in abstinentia, Fusas quadragenaria, scrutator al me cordium, infirmatusis virium, ad e reversis exipe, remissionis gratiam, multum quidem peccavimus, Sed parce confitentibus, tui quellaute nominis, conferme delam languitis, si corpus extra conteri, dona per abstinentiam, ie unet ut men sobria, Alla pe prosus criminu, presta beata trinitas, concede simplex unitas, ut fructuosa sint tuis, eic parcitatis munera. Amen. He is my comfort and my refuge. In him I put my trust. Blessed be the Lord, my rock, who trains my arms for battle, who prepares my hands for war. He is my love, my fortress, he is my stronghold, my Savior, my shield, my place of refuge. He brings peoples under my rule. Lord, what is man that you care for him? Mortal man that you keep him in mind. Man who is merely a breath, whose life fades like a shadow. Lower your heavens and come down. Touch the mountains, wreathe them in smoke. Flash your lightnings, rout the foe. Shoot your arrows and put them to flight. Reach down from heaven and save me. Draw me out from the mighty waters, from the hands of alien foes whose mouths are filled with lies, whose hands are raised in perjury. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. He is my comfort and my refuge. In him I put my trust. Blessed are the people whose God is the Lord. To you, O God, will I sing a new song. I will play on the ten-stringed harp. To you who give kings their victory, who set David your servant free. You set him free from the evil sword. You rescued him from alien foes, whose mouths were filled with lies, whose hands were raised in perjury. Let our sons then flourish like saplings, 
grown tall and strong from their youth. Our daughters graceful as columns, adorned as though for a palace. Let our barns be filled with overflowing, with crops of every kind. Our sheep increasing by thousands, myriads of sheep in our fields, our cattle heavy with young. No ruined wall, no exile, no sound of weeping in our streets. Happy the people with such blessings, happy the people whose God is the Lord. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Blessed are the people whose God is the Lord. Now the victorious reign of our God has begun. We praise you, O the Lord God Almighty, who is and who was. You have assumed your great power. You have begun your reign. The nations have raged in anger, but then came your day of wrath and the moment to judge the dead, the time to reward your servants, the prophets, and the holy ones who revere you, the great and the small alike. Now have salvation and power come, the reign of our God and the authority of his anointed one. For the accuser of our brothers is cast out, who night and day accused them before God. They defeated him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, love for life did not deter them from death. So rejoice, you heavens, and you that dwell therein. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Now the victorious reign of our God has begun. Submit to God, resist the devil and he will take flight. Draw close to God, and he will draw close to you. Cleanse your hands, you sinners. Purify your hearts, you backsliders. Be humbled in the sight of the Lord, and he will raise you on high. To you, O Lord, I make my prayer for mercy. To you, O Lord, I make my prayer for mercy. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. I make my prayer for mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. To you, O Lord, I make my prayer for mercy. Whosoever gives up his life for my sake in this world will find it again forever in the next, says the Lord. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones, 
and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Whosoever gives up his life for my sake in this world will find it again forever in the next, says the Lord. In his mercy, God sends the Holy Spirit to shine on us so that our lives may radiate holiness and faith. Let us raise our voices in prayer and say, Lord, give life to your people whom Christ has redeemed. Lord, source of all holiness, Draw bishops, priests, and deacons closer to Christ through the Eucharistic mystery. May they grow daily in the grace of their ordination. Teach Christ's faithful people to be devout and attentive at the table of his word and of his body, so that they may bring into their daily lives the grace they receive through faith and sacrament. Grant, Lord, that we may see in each person the dignity of one redeemed by your Son's blood, so that we may respect the freedom and the conscience of all. Teach us to restrain our greed for earthly goods and to have concern for the needs of others. Be merciful to your faithful people whom you have called to yourself today. Grant them the gift of eternal happiness. Pater noster, qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra, Panem nostrum quotidianum da nobis hodie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, et ne nos inducas in tentationem, sed libera nos amalo. Prompt our actions with your inspiration, we pray, O Lord and further them with your constant help, that all we do may always begin from you and by you be brought to completion through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat et ab malo defendat, et ad vitam perducat eternam. Amen. Ave Regina Celorum, Ave Domina Angelorum, Salve Radi, Salve Porta, Ex Quam Mundo Lux Est Orta, Gaude Virgo Gloriosa, Super omne speciosa, valeo valde decora, et pro nobis Christum exora.